I'm a Hoosier. <laughs> <laughs> and that means basketball. Clint, did you see the statue unveiled of Oscar Robertson? Uh, that was oh, yeah. beautiful. You yeah. know, I was I grew up in a time where Oscar Rob Oscar Robertson was a real player, and my dad was a a basketball player, Fair State College in Michigan back in the day. Uh, and Oscar Robertson was one of the names he brought up. Probably brought up Oscar Robertson more than he brought up Bob Cousy. Yeah. But I followed the Big O even as a young child. Uh, in, in his, the way he carried his game, the way, you know, the energy he brought to his game and the fact that he had to be a trailblazer as well in the NBA because of color. Um, you know, he basically could have been a part of the NBA's, you know, Jackie Robinson story. Yeah. Um, tremendous talent, remarkable human being. Um, so I thought that, you know, the, the statue was just so timely, so well done and, and what an honor to a very deserving man. Yeah. Jerry West, who Hall of Famer, often says that Oscar is the best he ever played with or against. They were Olympic teammates. We also want to talk about Caitlin Clark. She this week became the NCAA, the new NCAA women's all-time leading scorer, and she did it with a shot from about 35 feet out. There are some things to, I want to bring up about Caitlin. Her journey, the manner in which she's carried herself, everything's authentic, everything's real. The talent, the uh, character, the manner in which she has handled the ascent and what she has meant for women's basketball as a showcase this season. Really remarkable. What a fantastic story. And it's been ongoing. It's going to play itself out this year. There's going to be more basketball for her in her future. Did she have her foot on the logo when she, when she <laughs> <laughs> set that thing flying? I mean, and it was effortless. That's the other part of it. It was effortless. And it's just what she does and the confidence in which she has in playing. And she did it against my team, the Michigan Wolverines. I think it's always cool when a, a story like that can, can get everybody's attention, get national attention. And how about the ticket prices last night for the game? Wow. I don't know if you read any of the articles on that. You know, they're $300 to get a ticket to watch her play. Uh, never been seen before. Probably never seen again. Who knows? But she's done it with grace. She's done it with selflessness. Yeah. She's done it with a team first mentality, even though she knows they're going to rely upon her. She's the go-to person on the team. Yeah. And the way that she does draw her teammates in and let them, they celebrate with her. Um, they're not all just celebrating about her. She, she, you know, that term mudita, you know, expressive joy for somebody else's success. You can see that her teammates have that for her.